a leak it happens right ea leaked the upcoming week that we're getting into for friday now these things happen companies make mistakes people are blowing it out of the water like it's absolutely the worst thing in the world or how could how could this happen how could they let it happen companies make mistakes right how often you go to tim hortons and you get a coffee wrong it happens guys it's nothing to be upset about it's nothing to be mad about unfortunately we lose the hype on what we could have for next week but it gives us a lot of information going forward and we're going to dive into a couple of those things we're going to talk about the leaks we're going to talk about the players and we're going to talk about everything you need to know so i hope you do enjoy it if you do, hit that thumbs up. It's slightly different than what I usually do, but it is what it is. First, we're gonna start with the leak itself, which is going to be one, the MSP, the 99 MSP for next week is right here. So if you didn't know that, there you go. This is what we have. Peter Morazic, Nikolai Ehlers is going to be the 98 MSPs. And then Jason Robertson will be your 99. That was one thing that they accidentally put on Twitter yesterday. It's unfortunate. I wanted to drop it all yesterday, but I wanted to know I wanted to kind of go about this the right way. So yesterday it, it is what it is. And then also they dropped this one here, which is going to be next Friday's 99 build MSPs. So there is a couple of ways we can go about looking at this and go about doing this in the best way for us starting now. Because how can we use this information? Right? Because this is a big leak for both events, but it is kind of a good way for you either to get ahead of it or at least you now know so let's dive into a couple of these things guys because now that we have the leaks we have the images we know what we're doing we can know what we talk about and prepare for it so you might be asking yourself how can we prepare for it and the best way to say it is this set here in the 87s to the 99 now that we know it's jason robertson do you want that card do you want that card or do you not want that card that, that, that's where it all boils down to because if you do not want 99 jason robertson you don't need to save these msps which gives you the flexibility of doing so much more and what is that so much more in sets for starters you can complete the msps twice only twice so that means you could only use eight of the msps to get your cheap 99s well, now you can use all eight again. So if you had all six of these built up, which I did because I didn't know who the 99 was, now I don't need to worry about it. Now I have all three Ovechkin, Crosby, and Yager because I now know I want all three more than I want Jason Robertson. And how I do that is you turn in the MSPs. I made a video about it go check it out it's how to build cheap 99s and they've only gotten cheaper doing it this way you take the msps you power them up to a 97. i explain it all how to make it cheap how to do it the best way possible go check that video out but if you already know how then you already know what you're doing you're turning the msps in for your sydney crosby because you're not saving them for the jason robertson and with that being said we also now know who the msps are going to who the 99s are going to be next week you know Sackick, stamkos messier if you want them as well you know you can get these cards prepared and built up and if you're wondering how i got these cards so quick it's because they are so cheap right 20, 92 overalls or higher are going for like twenty thousand coins which is ridiculous to think that i can get seven power-up collectibles for 19,000. 19,000 coins now and they just keep dropping they'll be 18,000 soon so you can get seven power of collectibles and a player pack to help you get the 99s it's crazy it's absolutely crazy for 19,000 you do this four times you get yourself 28 out of the 31 collectibles you need for a 97 it is wild guys so that is the benefit of this event that is the benefit of the the, the leak and how you can prepare for it is do you want Jason Robertson. If your answer is yes, then keep storing your cards in the set and make sure you don't turn them in. If the answer is no, as you can see, I already pulled two out. If the answer is no, then you're using these cards for the 99s. Like right here, I'm going to build these two cards up to 97 overalls, and that is my Mark Messier or my Joe Sackick. And then the other one can either be my Joe Sackick or my Steven Stamkos. I'm going to wait and see which 99 I like better, but now I know. I could go ahead and build all the Crosbys, the Ovechkins, the, Yager, the Yagers, which they are unreal, by the way. And I can just get them done. And I can use these cards to build up the ones we're getting next week. So that is that is how you're going to do it, guys. That is how you're going to do it. The first thing you got to ask yourself is, do I want Jason Robertson? And then after you answer that question, do I want all three Yager, Ovechkin, and Crosby? Or 
if you can only build so many now you know what six you can have so now you know do i have to get this done this week i want all three of these guys more than i want next week so do i have to grind out and get all three of these guys because i don't want anyone else or are you sitting there thinking well i want a jogger i wanted ovechkin but i want messier and sakic more so now i'm going to store my stuff i'm going to hang on to my stuff knowing what's coming out next week where now I can hold my stuff and get ready for next week and get ready for the cards I want. So th this is why I wanted to make this video, but I wanted to wait and I wanted to do it where we could break it all down and talk about it. I just didn't want to rush it out and say like, hey, there's a big leak. I wanted you guys to have all the information on how you could use this properly. And that is the leak, guys. That is the leak. Those, those th six cards that we now know about, unfortunately, it ruined kind of what's going on and what's going to happen. But... They haven't really messed up all too much. This is the next thing I wanted to talk about. They haven't really messed up all too much. So they they messed up the game modes when I first came out. It, it was unfortunate. It was like, like kind of slapped together, but it happens, right? And then they messed up the Matthew Rempe, the 98 Matthew Rempe. People that were supposed to get a 99 got a 98. And then this year, it, companies mess up, right? Orders get messed up all the time. You go to a company, your order gets messed up all the time. It happens. It's not the end of the world. We can utilize it to make the best of it, but we don't need to be mad about it. There's nothing to be mad about, guys. Hey, have fun. Get ready for this event coming up that we now know about and the event we're in now because these cards are all amazing. But thank you guys for watching this video. Till next time, ciao, ciao.